Hi there, this is a short video about the Farming Simulator 19 1.2 patch. It's December uh, 2018 and this is on the Xbox. It probably applies to all of them. Uh, you see that I've highlighted the main feature, it, which is a, a, a landscaping tool that they've added, which is a good thing uh, for most people. But unfortunately, uh, th you're going to have a major problem problem with it uh, and that's just a list I'm I'm letting you see the list of uh, fixes most of which should have been fixed before the game were released by the way but I won't go into that yeah yeah it's a very good and very powerful tool and you can use it on the console as well which is unusual uh, and I don't really know why they've released it because it is very powerful but one thing that you do have to do is straight the straight away the first thing you must do before you use this tool without fail is turn the auto save off because while the tool is super powerful it doesn't have an undo feature so if like me uh, you have absolutely no artistic skill whatsoever everything that you do is going to be permanent and everything that you do is going to cost you money so if you've invested uh, a lot of time into your map and then you start with this landscaping tool thinking I'll just do this I'll just do that everything you do is permanent and there's no way to undo it at all so you, you could end up with a massive mess it's a bit like giving uh, a five-year-old a fantastically massive bulldozer and saying go do my garden for me uh, and see how that turns out I don't think it's going to be too pretty by the time it's finished the tool does have some shortcomings that it uh, apart from having no undo feature which is the biggest is that uh, it doesn't remove trees which is very strange oversight because that's the main thing that I ever want to get rid of because the logging's so terrible. I rather suspect that this uh, update's come about, this part of the update's come about, because the placeables are so broken. I think they're so broken. They leave great big ramps in your landscape when you when you put the uh, put put the things down, and also they're very very awkward to put down. So it'd be very handy to flatten some terrain first and then blend it in. But I don't know if you're noticing, but I have not. Uh, I'm not showing you how to do anything and that's because I'm absolutely useless at it so I'm not ever going to use it <laughs> but there will be some people out there that will uh, I'll do some fantastic things with it I'm sure and if you look on YouTube I'm, you'll be able to find out how to use it I think thanks for watching